Hello friends, in this video we are going to learn how to make jQuery index call in ASP.NET web forms. For example, we want to add two numbers using jQuery index. We are going to use HTML buttons with type equal to button because we don't we are not going to submit the forms and we are going to use an element on click as uh, just the naming the function over here add is the same as we are going to use over here and then this is the ajax structure uh, here is the method of posting the data and this is the page name there here our uh, web service is like we are having in the code behind file over here this is the name is add numbers and we are going to use the same name over here uh, actually if we use the different name when then we are going to server error i will show i will show you how it works okay then here we are going to pass the parameters i mean the inputs or uh, like uh, the name should be same like number one number two like we have number one and number two uh, the sequence of these numbers doesn't matter and just we need to provide whatever over here we need to provide all these parameters that are over here this is content tab like we are into uh, the type of content where we need to post that is uh, json and the data type that we are going to have on return this is json and if our index call is successfully performed then we are going to uh, return our reply over here and if there is some error there will be cache over here let's move to the code behind file here we have a web method uh, this is the sp.net web service and uh, it's public and make it static this is the return type and then this is the method name we are going to that we have already defined over here and these are the parameters that inverse to this web service so we want to add these two numbers first we converted these numbers to integer and then we are adding and then we are converting to string and then returning okay now let's uh, run this program here we have first number just enter your first number enter your second number and just press add numbers okay we just got the response from server uh, this response is not from uh, jQuery side or client side we're just getting from server so I hope you got the purpose of Ajax calls uh, like we have added the numbers we have get the response from server and the page is not loaded thanks for watching see you in next video